Thanks for checking out Scotty's Hobbies. Today we're looking at this 2014 Toyota Tacoma. This should be the same, if not very similar, to the 2005 to 2015 year makes with the V6 4.0 liter engine. Here's your underhead label. It tells you a lot of information. One, that it is California certified and a 2014 year model. Right here gives you all of your emissions components, such as your air pump, your two air fuel ratio sensors instead of oxygen sensors in the front, and then you have two heated O2 sensors that check for efficiency, which are rear O2 sensors. We're going to start this video off by pointing out the PCV valve right here on the driver's side valve cover. I do my best to put a link in the description below if you need to buy these parts as well. Go ahead and check them, please. And while you're watching, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. Right here on top on the driver's side is also going to be the EVAP canister purge solenoid. Looks like it should be real simple to replace if you're chasing a EVAP issue. I also have videos on how to check those purge solenoids too if you check out my video library. Over here on to the passenger side, you are going to have... The air injection pump right here on top of the passenger side front wheel well, right there. Looks like it should be pretty simple to replace as well. And again, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell if you would like. I post a lot of these emissions components locations videos. Down here on the bottom on the passenger side is going to be your bank one oxygen sensors we're going to start off with bank one center two your rear o2 sensor this one measures catalyst efficiency your bank one center one sensor is right there out of the exhaust manifold up on top real hard to see but it is up there the rear o2 sensor looks like be real easy to replace the rear O2 sensors are going to be replaced on the P0420, P0421, P0422 codes if you have them, uh, if your catalytic converter is not bad. Over here on the driver's side, you are going to find the other bank, which is going to be bank 2. Again, your front oxygen sensor is actually an air fuel ratio sensor on this vehicle. So your bank two sensor one air fuel ratio sensor is right there off the exhaust manifold on the driver's side, right above or in front of the catalytic converter. Your bank two sensor two oxygen sensor in this case only measures catalyst efficiency and is right here, right behind the catalytic converter. These ones look like they'd be real simple to replace. Again, if you need these parts, make sure you check for a link in the description below and please purchase them through those links. Getting back onto the EVAP system, here in the rear of the truck, you're going to find the EVAP canister and off of the EVAP canister, the EVAP vent solenoid. In this video, I do not point out the vent solenoid, but we are going to show you the EVAP canister itself. Right here in front of the axle, right under the bed is the EVAP canister itself. Your vent solenoid is down there too. If this video helped you out, make sure you like, subscribe, share. I will see you on the next hopefully helpful video.